Hey, so in this video I'll be doing a review for the TV show Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 2, Episode 1, Shadows. So, it takes place months after uh, the Season 1, and they're, like, the whole entire show has completely changed. It's more darker in tone, it's more serious, it's not that many laughs, like, there are laughs, but not as many, like, that's probably because people were complaining that there's too many laughs, but I wasn't. I actually want, I like the laughs. So, but it's a more serious tone, it, every, like, everything has changed. The characters have changed, uh, Sky is no longer the happy, upbeat, uh, hacker-ish person anymore. She's a S.H.I.E.L.D. agent, more serious, doesn't, uh, doesn't want to talk to Ward. Uh, she just more like serious. Like want to get the job done. I'm talking about Ward, he's now he's been in prison for whatever months it's been off. Uh, and he's been so depressed. He he's been he actually tried to hurt himself. He uh the the only person he wants to talk to is Sky. He will not talk to anyone else. Uh, for uh, Coulson, he's di he's the director. He's giving orders. He's been trying to find uh, new recruits for for Shield. That and they're trying to find out who's Hydra, who's not. Uh, so he's been traveling a lot. He's been really getting tired. Uh, so he's. And he's no longer in the real, like, field a lot. He's more behind the scenes. Uh, for Fitz and Simmons, they, I think Fitz has changed the most. He, they, like, Fitz and Simmons used to be, like, comic, comic relief. Like, they could finish each other's sentences. Uh, like, they had, like, one mind. And now, in... Uh, this ep season, uh, Simmons is good. He, he, she left S.H.I.E.L.D. So, but she's still on the show. Uh, Fitz has, has been hallucinating, uh, Simmons for who knows how long. He, he's been actually thinking that she's there, but he's not, she's not. And, uh, Fitz has been a bit slow, like, he can't figure out a lot of stuff as fast as he used to be. Like he could, he used to be able to think of things right away, and now he's like, tr he's having so much trouble trying to figure out how to, what this is and what it is, and like even trying to figure out how to actually finish the sentence, like a word, like he can't remember words sometimes. So, like. He changed a lot. Uh, for May, nothing really has changed. She's the badass person that oh she always is, even though she hasn't hasn't really shown that much badass yet. Uh, the only thing that has changed is now she's she has been the SO of of uh, Sky ever since whenever they wanted her to get tra trained, but she's been the, her at Sky's SO. So, uh, for Trip, nothing has changed. She's, he's more, he's more of like the upbeat person, and he's not, he's not a series regular yet, but he will be in a lot of the episodes, uh, but he hasn't, hasn't changed at all. Uh, for new cast members, we get Isabel Hartley, Played by uh, Lucy Lawless, and she's pretty good. Uh, I don't know how much of how many episodes she's gonna be in. I'll talk about that later. But uh, we also get uh, Lance Hunter, or no, yeah, Lance Hunter, played by Nick Blood, and he's like as he's a series regular, so he's coming back. Uh, and uh, uh, 
Other than that, there's Kraken the villain and Absorby Man. That was the main main focus of this episode. But Kraken had, was only teased. He was in the beginning of like the 1940s, and somehow he's gonna be in present. How I don't know how he got back. I don't know how he's in present day. But that's what I liked about this episode. They showed a bit of clips from uh, what's it called the past with a. Uh, Peggy Carter and the Howling Commandos, and it, it teased, like it showed how uh, they got a new, the first OE4, they sh actually got, uh, uh, it was called the Tahiti Blue Drug Guy, or that's what we're assuming, because he had, he had, all we saw was like a blue arm and a tattoo ish on him that looked like the guy from Tahiti, and yeah, they got, and then they got that Hydra agent from, uh, that's now in present day. So, it, and in the present day, they're going to all focus on a lot of that stuff. What they, what they found in present, past day, they're actually going to, they're going to focus more on that. Like, they're going to focus on, like, the Tahiti, uh, sim or the, the symbols that Coulson was drawing. <laughs> Uh, which is going to tie to uh, Sky's past, uh, and the OA4 somehow is going to connect it to Sky because it has the exact same symbols as the Tahiti guy or Tahiti uh, stuff. So it was te pretty much all teasing. Uh, what's it called Sky? Sky stuff for there for Kraken. He actually is high, like works for Hydra, and he wanted wanted the OA4, and he asked he told the Zorb man to get it, pretty much. So it it's all connected, pretty much. Like it's so fun, and like the new characters weren't really introduced, like, they, they were introduced, and we're probably going to get to know them throughout the season, but, like, they didn't really acknowledge who they were, they were just introduced at the beginning of the episode, and say, here you go, here's the new, here's the new cast members, and we're going to talk about, talk about them later on, because a lot of people didn't like uh, no, actually, we didn't really know know who they, the other cast members were in the beginning of the season till later on. So there's more there's more of a mystery of this season. <laughs> like we don't know who they are at all. Uh, but and uh, as far as I know, uh, Absorbing Man it will be coming back for a couple episodes and he did not talk at all in this episode that much. So he's more he is more of a mystery too. He they teased a bit of his powers but didn't uh, totally acknowledge how he got it and but it shows a lot of what he can do. He can absorb pretty much anything. Or it pretty he can absorb anything. He absorbed through glass, he absorbed uh, what's called a wall. Uh, it was called the ground. He absorbed metal. He absorbed everything. He absorbed a diamond. It was and the effects that they used for him was pretty cool. It was uh, I liked it a lot. Uh, and then at the very end, they showed that they got a new. A new like bus plane ish, so they could fly around, it so without being caught because this plane is now invisible. Like they can turn the bus invisible, or the I don't know why I keep saying the bus. I'm used to saying that one, but they're uh, the plane. <laughs> I'll just call it the new bus. But yeah, this new bus can be turned invisible and now they can hide out 
in plain sight. So it's it was a really fun episode, like how it's more serious. Like I I don't like serious stuff. I like com I like comedy, but I hope they have a bit of comedy in this. Cause like like last season, how they had comedy, but to keep it serious so no one like complains too much. <coughs> so yeah, that was, that's just my thought on uh, this episode. Comment down below what you thought of, of it and what I should review next. See ya.